The executive director of Safe Space Initiative, Ms. Tosin Akimbode Osho, has reiterated that sexual-based violence, GBV, is one of the most common forms of gender-based violence in Nigeria. She highlighted that feminist movements have long utilized art as a tool to address sexual-based violence. During a stage play organized by her organization at the Brazilian Embassy, Ms. Osho underscored the significance of the play as an illustration of their efforts to raise awareness about sexual and gender-based violence, especially at the grassroots level as she stressed the societal role in shaping attitudes towards this violence. Addressing the issues of gender-based violence, gender norms, and bringing up solutions on how to address this issue from the grassroots. So the stage play is about a middle-aged couple and how they mirror the society in terms of gender norms and how the society plays a catalyst role in how we see gender-based violence in the society. On his part, Charge the Affairs, Brazilian Embassy in Abuja, Mr. João Marcelo Soares, emphasized that gender-based violence, GBV, is a significant concern, adding that educating communities about gender equality and the dangers of GBV can lead to a shift in social norms. This is part of building a better society. You know? um, uh, Women has a, a very fundamental role in not only in um, economy but also in, uh, in in education, science, everything. You know, so we have to start addressing this issue for real, uh, gender inequality, and at the back of it, uh, gender-based violence. I think that um, I, we we should thank uh, the, the organizers for bringing this uh, this play to stage tonight. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to give its contribution to to the advocacy and to the and bringing awareness of this issue here in Abuja, here in Nigeria, and we from the Embassy of Brazil, we are very very proud of being part of that. Executive producer Miro Miro stage play Miss Osasu Edobo emphasized several challenges faced by survivors in society, such as self doubt, and advocated for more compassion towards victims of abuse. Self-doubt, realizing, feeling or thinking that you haven't made the right choice. Societal blame, society consistently stigmatizing you, telling you that you aren't worth anything without your marital title. And those kinds of norms, it's still gender norms, right? Gender norms affect them even when they leave, right? They are told you are nothing without a man, you have no covering, um, you know, and all those kind of conversations, they eat down on a woman's confidence and that's that's all she needs she needs her confidence to be able to walk through the pain and rigor of, you know of living that she has had to because even to live is a lot because if she has children then there's a lot of calculations to be made and so um, i think that it, the easiest thing to say will be that society needs to be kinder to survivors of abuse if she says that she's been abused believe her if she needs support hold her through it if whatever it is that is requisite for her to you know walk through the abuse give it to her she deserves safe space initiative is a non-profit organization using new media and technological solutions to help women and girls break free find shelter and recover from sexual and gender-based violence